This lesson helps you understand similar figures. Similar figures have the same shape, but are not necessarily the same size. If two polygons are similar, then corresponding angles are congruent, and corresponding sides are proportional. In this diagram, the two rectangles have congruent angles. If you check the ratios of the sides, you can see they are equal. The value of the ratio is the scale factor. So ABCD is similar to AFEG. When you name similar polygons, list the corresponding vertices in the same order. This wavy line is the symbol for similar. The similarity statement tells you which angles and sides are corresponding. Angle S corresponds to angle M. Angle R corresponds to angle N. And angle T corresponds to angle P. The ratios of the corresponding sides are SR over MN, RT over NP, and TS over PM. There are several methods for showing triangles are similar. The first is angle-angle similarity. If two angles of one triangle are congruent with two angles of another, then the triangles are similar. In this diagram, angles R and V are both 45 degrees, so they are congruent. The angles at point S are vertical angles, so they are congruent. Since the triangles have pairs of congruent angles, they are similar by angle-angle similarity. The second method is side-side-side similarity. If the corresponding sides of two triangles are proportional, then the triangles are similar. In this diagram, write the ratio of the shortest sides, the longest sides, and the remaining sides. You can see that the ratios are equal. So the triangles are similar by side, side, side similarity. The third method is side angle side. If an angle of one triangle is congruent to the angle of another triangle, and the sides that include the angle are proportional, then the triangles are similar. Angle K is shared by both triangles, so the triangles have a congruent angle. Next, check the ratios of the sides that include the angle. For the longest sides, you have 12 over 12 plus 3, which is 12 over 15. For the other sides, you have 8 over 8 plus 2 which is 8 over 10. Since both ratios are equal to 4 over 5, the triangles are similar. You can use proportions to find unknown links in similar figures. In this diagram, triangle ABC is similar to DEC. So the ratio of AB over DE equals the ratio of BC over EC. With these dimensions, the proportion is 18 over X equals 8 plus 16 over 16. 
Notice the length of BC is 8 plus 16. So that's 18 over X equals 24 over 16. Cross multiply and divide by 24. And the missing length is 12. To avoid confusion when similar figures overlap, you can separate them. This lesson helps you understand similar figures. And this lesson was brought to you by the Math Fun Academy. Its continuing mission to explore strange new worlds, to seek out new math and new equations, to boldly go where no math student has gone before.